Hi Virgo, I'm back with another weekly reading and I heard a channeled song for you while I was meditating on your energy and it was by Niles Barkley and it's called Crazy. So while I was singing that song, I heard that someone's getting constant karma for what they did to you and somebody else here. I've got an energy of crazy making here. Someone made out like you was crazy. That's what I'm picking up. And I'm also hearing institutionalized. So I feel like someone could have had you sectioned under the Mental Health Act. And I'm hearing a family member. I'm also hearing a father figure here. So this could be your father or somebody else's father who put you away in some sort of institution here because you found out something about them. I feel like something came to you. This could have been in a dream. You could have had a daydream, some sort of epiphany or download here that you received about what happened to somebody else here because I did hear you and somebody else. So I feel like someone's passed over here. I've got a strong energy here and it's heavy. This is a deep reading. That's what I'm picking up here. I feel like it's that person's death. Like you had some sort of epiphany or some sort of download. This could be a channel message or a dream. But someone passed away and someone was the cause of this death. And I feel like you spoke out about this. You told someone that you felt like someone had caused someone's death. This could be a murder, but I'm hearing spell work here. And I'm hearing it's all hidden. Something was hidden. Someone took someone's life here with spell work, with magic. And you received the message. That's what I'm picking up. You started to channel messages, receive downloads. You could have confided in a father figure or others in, in your family. I'm hearing family members here. That someone took someone's life. Someone could have paid a witch or paid for some sort of black magic. I'm hearing death spells here. I'm hearing obia here. And I feel like you, you found out and you, you spilled the beans. You spilled the tea about what happened to this person. And I feel like you even know that this father energy, look at that, I dropped half of the deck here. So this is very messy what people have done, not only to you, but somebody else here. I'm hearing a practitioner was paid here to end someone's life, to do some sort of death magic here. I've got an energy of you healing from some sort of institution here so you could have got out i'm here and escape from some sort of institution where you've been sectioned under the mental health act because you knew the truth you knew too much here and people were saying that you was crazy but i feel like you're very intelligent and everything you said was the truth here you definitely listen to your angels, you listen to your guides, and you know deep down within that this is the truth. You could have been pilled, I'm hearing injected here in this institution to shut you down, slow you down, or stop your movement here. I'm hearing like heavy throat chakra energy, like someone silenced you. And I've got an energy of someone putting their hand over your mouth. And if you look at this card, I don't know if you can see there, but there's a skeleton face with a hand covering the mouth here. I feel like whoever passed away here, I'm hearing a sister. This could be your father's sister. This could be an auntie energy, or this could be your sister who passed over here. But whoever this person is, they're sending these messages to you. They're some sort of angel that's been sent into your life to reveal the truth. That's what I'm picking up here. So you're not mad, you're not crazy. You felt this in your spirit, in your soul. I'm hearing sacrifice here, I'm hearing necromancy. I'm also hearing human sacrifice. I feel like someone wanted to replace this person here. I feel an energy of this person 
practicing some sort of demonic satanic shit here where they stole someone's soul here or they purposely took someone out so they could embody their spirit i'm picking that up a lot but i'm seeing a lot of dead people around you who are angry who are sad that this person had been taken away too soon here so these could be your ancestors that have all come to speak to you to help you to protect you to guide you here so whoever was you know insinuating you're crazy you're not here i do feel like other people have been turned against you as well i feel like you've been completely alone going through this whole i'm here in controversy I'm hearing mystical energy, so you could be under magic too, or you've been placed under magic several times. I'm seeing several arrows here, and I'm seeing like demonic spirits here, like someone sent, you know, this could be the death angel here, or some sort of demonic spirits or predators to take someone's life this could have possibly happened while they were sleeping i'm hearing that as well but i definitely see that someone passed away suddenly i'm hearing unfortunately this person could have been in their early 30s i'm picking that up as well but i definitely feel like someone took over your your life here your soul someone tried to control the outcome of what they've done here and this person is some sort of perpetrator some sort of predator who preyed on your intelligence here who shut you down who tried to take you off some sort of pedestal here you could have been someone who was in the spotlight i'm picking that up as well and because of this person's death you've been completely thrown out of this whole whatever platform you're on or whatever sort of high status you had here you've been like cast down or cancelled or you know sold out by the people who love you who you loved you know by completely everybody here I feel like you're someone who's very, you know, intelligent, you've studied, you have a lot of knowledge, but you've also studied, you know, what people do here behind the scenes, what people are doing in the darkness here, and whatever they did in the dark, it came to light, it came to you, you had this imagery vision you had this dream you had some sort of inkling instinct here that it was this person this father energy who could have hunted this person down trapped them or provided someone with the power to take this person's soul here i definitely feel like because i've got goosebumps and i feel like the hairs on my arms are standing up here you're definitely heavily guided here. You have a lot of ancestors around you, but you still have this person around you who could be stuck between worlds. That's what I'm picking up here because this person's life was taken, taken quickly and taken without, you know, God's authority here. I feel like this person has been placed in what they call the duart here. This is like a muggy place. This is like in between worlds. This is like hell. This is like, you know, imagine like a pool of muddy trenches. This person's stuck in that place here. And this person's crying for the truth, crying for help, crying to get to, you know, heaven here. This person's stuck that's what i'm picking up so they could be roaming the do art stuck in the do art or they're definitely stuck between worlds and they're still you know on this earth realm but could possibly be invisible to others but visible to you i'm picking that up as well this person's spirit has not been saved because it's been taken 
it was ostracized I'm hearing it was taken or you've been ostracized here you've been pushed out out of the picture out of the you know you can't even voice your opinion right now because you look crazy but you know it's not you deep down inside you know it's this father energy you know this person has done something evil here and they've taken somebody's life and I feel the energy of you know not just you being placed under magic there's other people here who have been turned against the truth by using some sort of sympathy magic or spell work when it comes to this person I also got an energy of money here. This could have been done for money so this person could take over somebody else's life or position here. This could have been your life or position but I definitely feel like someone's life, position, money, possessions, you know, estate here has been taken, wrongfully taken from the, you know, the person it, belongs to here so you know this father figure could have taken authority over someone's pension or someone's sort of you know their will on hearing will and testament here i definitely feel like this broke you not only did it break your heart just knowing that this person passed away it broke your soul knowing that you knew that this person was the cause of this person's death you watch this all play out with tears in your eyes yeah i see floods of tears i see you pleading begging people to listen to you people you know that you loved here looked at you like you've gone insane like this can't happen like who told you this you had a dream so what kind of energy but I'm telling you now that God always shows you the truth in your dreams here he will always come to you with what is really going on behind the scenes and he will allow you to piece the puzzle together and you did that you listened to you God you you accepted what had happened to this person I feel an energy of sorrow here like I can see you at this person's funeral just dying inside because you knew the truth you knew how this person's death you know suddenly happened here and it broke your heart just to know that the people that you love are so wicked would you know take someone's soul take someone's life so young would you know be playing with this shit that's what i'm picking up as well i feel like you're quite young here and people you know they assume because of your age how could you possibly know this shit how could you you know know anything about this but i do feel like you you know you delve deep into you know what people do behind the scenes when it comes to magic and spell work and you know that you know people can and kill you with spell work, death spells, death magic, hearing over here. Someone stole someone's spirit. Look at this. Free will is in reverse. Free spirit is in reverse. This person's spirit is trapped. They're not free. Their spirit was stolen. That's what I'm picking up here. This is, you know, this is deep. Like someone not only took this person's life and possessions, they actually took their spirit and could be living in the abundance that this person had set out by the Most High here. I do feel like deep down, you've stopped talking about this. You've completely stop speaking on it because you're always shut down you're always blocked from telling the truth here so you could be seen as a liar which is wrong here and this person standing right next to you energetically trying to guide you to the truth or trying to allow you to speak your truth but i do feel like your throat chakra is blocked here this person could have done chakra work on this person i'm seeing that as well like root work or I definitely feel like that's been done to you to silence your throat here because you're not saying nothing anymore you're holding all this information back or in I definitely feel like these people pretend to be you know of God 
pray, could possibly even go to church or they're part of some sort of church here or religion or they're just, you know, they're worshipping the devil here behind the scenes. That's what I'm picking up here, but pretending to be of God here. I definitely see that this put you in like a mental prison here like you you felt like you had gone crazy because you know you was basically MK ultra here you was you know telling the truth but you were shut down by lawyers who made everyone else think that what you knew what you could see was crazy when you know you know, it was them, they're the crazy ones, not you. This is some severe mental illness where somebody was so jealous or so spiteful or so hurtful that they would do anything to have a better life, to have this person's life, to have this person's money. And you know, they'd do anything to have that richness or that, you know what I mean? This person pretends to be nice and have good manners and, you know, pretends to be kind, but this person is evil. Look at this wolf in the background here and it's in reverse and it's just preying on this lovely girl here, whether you're male or female, you're very lovely. You know, this is some sort of narcissist. And look what I pulled here. I've got the sacrifice card here. So, you know, this, you know, this is the truth. Someone sacrificed somebody here. And you know, this person could have been an empath. This person was very loving, very loyal, very caring. This person could have had, you know, like a stately home. I've got an energy of like a beautiful old sort of town with an old sort of a home with old finishings and furnishings. And you know, like beautiful wooden sort of oak chairs and you know what I mean like a living room with beautiful suites and you know what I mean this person was well off well presented well you know thought of highly respected here and someone you know they wanted to take that away from this person they basically took this person's life look at that and I feel like you're the only one who's trying to connect the dots here you're the only person who's trying to piece this puzzle together you could have been there when this person passed on that's what I'm picking up as well and they suddenly just died for no reason and you know you're an empath you have a lot of compassion for this person and a lot of compassion for the people who've been in your life they know you're kind they know you're sympathetic they know you know that you are a lovely person deep down but they listen to this father energy that's what I keep hearing there was under some sort of sympathy spell and I keep seeing the word sim what is it simpatico I think it means sympathy in French or something or, or another language I'm, I'm picking up French here so you could be French or this person could have been French or connected to France. I'm here in Paris as well. I just heard Israel, so take it how it resonates. But I definitely see that this person gave this person's life as some sort of offering in a sacrifice here to get something, to gain something or to gain this person's spirit. I'm hearing spiritism. And I heard this yesterday, and this is, you know, a very common thing that's been going on over centuries behind the scenes where someone will offer a person's life or blood for money, goods, for, you know, richness, for sacrifice here. This person could have been someone who did this with animals in the past too. Seeing like animal sacrifice in here, this person could be connected to some sort of secret group 
who do this sort of shit or they're definitely paying these people to do this kind of shit here they definitely have some sort of links to a religion here look at this the jealousy card this person was jealous of whoever passed away here they had a severe jealousy and they wanted to punish this person maybe they thought they was doing better than them in life maybe you know this person had done so much wrong in the past that they could never live up to this person's light here or this person was just full of darkness and they wanted to steal this person's light i'm also getting an energy of this person being in the spotlight here as well like this person could have been a star just heard prince this could be linked to prince or you could know prince or you know you're linked to celebrities here but i definitely feel like somebody took somebody's life here and it's some sort of father masculine energy here who was jealous of this person's light skills ability could have been just even you know the fact that this person has a lot of love people adored them they had some sort of mansion or stately home or you know i see a big massive home with like flights of stairs marble arches and you know like marble stone sort of you know what i mean like monuments and you know antiques i'm seeing a lot of shit like that and i'm definitely seeing something supernatural went on here some sort of magic i did here over i had death spells here as well i definitely see that somebody you know someone came for this person it could have been the grim reaper and suddenly took them away here this person could have connections to water i'm also getting an energy of like fire here so this could be a water sign a fire sign who did this and i definitely see there's a lot of protection around you since you've been through what you've been through here i feel like your guides are surrounding you your spirit guides and this person who's died is in like a dark sort of matter energy here because they was wrongfully murdered during some sort of sacrifice or spell work here. You know, you're going through some sort of rebirth here where you're being resurrected here because you've started to heal from the pain that you was in here. You've not only unlocked your chakras, you've unlocked your angels. So you've been doing the inner work here and that's maybe when, you know, you started to connect with this past on loved one who's stuck here. So you might have an idea that, you know, this person's near you, but you didn't know that this person was stuck in, you know, an otherworldly place. That's what I'm hearing as well. You definitely recovering and you definitely have your angelic protection with the 4-4 energy and you definitely reincarnated as someone even higher, someone even higher than you know you was in your previous energy. That's what I'm picking up as well. You could have moved away from these people. I feel that energy of you being secluded, isolated here, but you definitely moved away. You're only surrounded by God and your guides at this time. That's what I'm seeing as well. I definitely see that, you know, what happened to you was like an injustice. And I definitely feel like these people or this person who did this is paying for what they've done to you. I definitely see this person could be losing a job right now. They're being thrown out of some sort of corporation job or energy where there's making money or building something and people are starting to move away from this person now so you could have returned this magic back to sender i'm picking that up as well and you know it's hit this person 
So I see an energy of constant karma now. And this could possibly even go on for the rest of this person's life, even if they're quite old, for the rest of their days and infinity, they're going to be paying karma. This could affect their lineage or their family around them and their family line. And this will go on for centuries, that's what I'm hearing. Okay, so I'm gonna pull some cards from the wide away. I'm just going to cleanse this energy again because it's very heavy and dark. Look at the smoke here. It's very demonic, dark sort of forces working. I'm hearing they covered this up well and then they crazy made to get away with it because you clocked on. So this person was jealous of this person who they murdered here. And they definitely was jealous of their ambition. I've just dropped the whole deck here. They was definitely jealous of their ambition, what they do, what they brought to the table, and the life that they created as well. So I just feel like this is very sad. This is a real injustice here and it was all undercover. So no one would have ever worked this person out. And I feel that energy of hurt and pain because this is actually your father or someone's father here who you could have trusted with your life. And this is like a karmic cycle that you've been in for perhaps be the last 10 months you've been in this cycle and you know it's been heart destroying soul destroying that's what i'm picking up as well and people's lives have been completely ripped apart here because i've got the three of swords i feel like your heart broken you had you know, a severe breakdown. I'm hearing MK Ultra again. And like I said, this is a karmic cycle that you have completed now. You're now out of this. You've spoken your truth, even if you're holding back here. And you know, this is confirmation. That's what I'm picking up here because I feel like every time you speak to these people, they sort of shut you down or make you out to be crazy. So you stop talking, I get that. But at the same time, I feel like these people are gonna start to notice things for themselves. They're gonna start to notice that this person isn't who they said they was. They've been juggling energies here trying to get people on their side, trying to, you know, make out like you was grieving and you've had some sort of breakdown where you're talking, you know, a whole heap of crazy shit here, but I definitely feel like these are some psychopath energies. I'm hearing psychotic, I'm hearing narc energies here, who knew exactly what they was doing here. And they knew, you know, they had to cover it up. So they used you as a scapegoat. That's what I'm picking up. And look what I've called here. The devil in reverse. This is fatality. Someone took somebody's life here. And they've not just took their life. They've bound yours to, to this energy. So you're stuck in this dark force energy. But I feel like, you know, you guides are pulling you back through to the light here because you wasn't part of this. You didn't do this. You had nothing to do with this. They paid someone. They paid an evil, dark force here to do something demonic to somebody. Look at that. They could have even protected their self while doing this spell so that nothing would come back to them here. But I feel like you have broke that spell because you spoke the truth. Even though you went through what you went through, the minute you spoke on this spell, it broke. 
so don't worry because you know i mean disaster strikes here so these people are about to pay because you've got the wheel of fortune here this is anything you ask for this was a karmic cycle that you've completed here and you're about to go through energy of nothing but pure success look abundance this is healing on every level this is guidance from all of your angels you could be virgo north no that's what i'm picking up here and you're watching this reading because you're on your north node so i definitely see someone who's living in their purpose right now or you're about to step into your purpose because i do see an energy of you know you being fully guided towards your life purpose here with you guys with your angels with whoever this passed on loved one is to this person definitely died with the death card in reverse they lost their soul that's what i'm seeing here and i'm seeing this person stuck here they're stuck in this duo it's like a pool of mud muddy trenches and this um, Grim Reaper energy, this death angel on a white horse came for this person. That's what I'm picking up. This was a demonic sort of spirit who took this person and left them, you know, in a muddy trench here. That's what I'm picking up. This person stuck there and they have no way to get out because the truth is not being spoken. I feel like this person needs that truth to come out so that they can be free because they're trapped, they're stuck, they're isolated. But I do feel an energy of, like I said, this other person who did this has started to lose here. They're starting to lose their job, the money that they've acquired from this whole, you know, this whole engagement or arrangement that they took part in this whole plan, they're starting to lose everything now. The spell work's gone back to them and their chakras are blocked now. So this person could be going through some sort of breakdown or emotional breakdown. I do feel like you, you know, you need a lot of emotional healing right now. I'm hearing Sam Reiki can help you if you need my help please come to me because you know the blockages that you've you know got in your body are all because of this you know you felt like you was you know not only drugged you've been kidnapped you've been abused you've been locked away you've had handcuffs on at some point and you've been taken away here you had no say no authority you know, you've been wrongfully hung up here. You could have felt like committing suicide to get away from this or take your own life here. I definitely feel like a trial happened here where this other person who did this, they took everything with the 10 of ones. They absolutely took everything this person owned here. All their possessions. I see a home. I see land. I see a lot of money, things, you know. But at the same time, you've been given the strength here to start again, to start anew. And it's because you've cut these people off said this person is still trapped because you haven't spoke on this and you know like i said you're innocent you're young you're youthful and you should never have been put through any of this so i do feel like your angels are healing you not only are they healing you, they're, they're giving you the strength to get back up and go again. Because I feel like you've been defeated here. And look what I've just pulled. I've got the Magician. I've got the Seven of Swords. Look at this sneaky character here. Not only have they took, looted, stolen everything. They paid for magic to chop someone up here to get someone murdered, killed. Hurt. 
I'm hearing shot or stabbed here. This person could have gone to some sort of high witch here, or got a high witch sort of energy. And you know, they've been playing with spell work for some time here now. They've been having to play with spell work to keep covering up what they've done here to become the king of pentacles they just wanted this person's throne position status money home land life here this person could have grown a lot of fruit i see a big like land grass area where they you know they grew sort of fruits and they just blossom they could have had animals some sort of farm i'm picking up as well i definitely feel like you know this person made you out to be insane like you've gone from being this happy queen of cups who's always loving loyal and kind to you know thrown out crazy sort of you know you've just been trampled all over and stepped on but i do see victory coming in for you and this person's getting the role reversed on them with the return to sender energy you know these family members these friends these associates this person is linked to are all starting to move away from this person and cut them off here because they've noticed that something does not add up when it comes to you know what what this person's been doing here so they could have been you know like publicly spending this money and having some sort of glorious time here and people have started to look at this person and and notice that this person you know they was in everything for money here this isn't right this person's just taken the lot and they've sort of ran with it and pushed you out so people are talking about this person and people are moving away from them i do see you know whatever you've dreamed of here whatever you saw in this vision is the truth you do know the truth and you're being you know you're being rewarded by god here you're you're being helped to step back up you're being given every single cup you lost back here and this includes your health to your mental health and your physical health because i feel like your whole self was affected where you know you could have lost a lot of weight or you wasn't even being able to walk or talk properly i'm seeing you getting everything back that you lost here and i do see you know you overcoming whatever adversities you've been through when it comes to mental health and when it comes to you know these secrets that you've uncovered here i do see you walking into a happier time but this other person they're about to lose everything they've taken here i see it all slipping from their hands or it's slipping through their fingers i'm hearing because it wasn't rightfully theirs somebody else might actually take them to court and try and get some you know some sort of inheritance back or you know the rightful people are going to come in and you know examine this person and see what this person's been doing i'm also hearing this person could just dishevel and pass on their self after what they've done because you spoke the truth i'm seeing a word here and it says victory and i'm also hearing yesterday and i'm seeing tuesday as well so if those days are significant or you know that word victory you know you're about to receive some sort of victory here because i see some news coming forward and this could be across the globe here i feel like someone's gonna contact you and tell you the truth someone that could have been involved in this this could be this high witch this person could have some sort of heavy conscience since they've been playing with you with magic here or since this person has passed on because they know it was wrong that they took someone out the picture here they could have realized that you know this father energy did all of this for you know material goods and 
some sort of profit here this person has also been receiving karma for you know for helping this person i'm seeing that as well and this is the truth with the ace of swords not only did this person's life get taken so did their gold so did their goods so did their land you know all these thoughts you receive was the truth and they did have magic placed upon them this is so sad and wicked that someone could take someone's life just so that they could have their sort of status or you know a state here this is sickening and i do see these people this person are under mental sort of you know attack here this could be a spiritual attack i feel like god has placed them in spiritual jail when it comes to the mind for what they've been doing they've been you know they've been moving you know undercover here they've been passing money to and fro here they've been living some sort of high life with this person's funds who has passed over here and they think they've got away with it they think they're protected they think that you know not only are they not going to pay they're going to pay and so is their entire lineage for centuries and this is sad because this is going to affect you know newborn babies you know spiritual realms this is going to affect you know people that haven't even been thought of in this line here in this family line i see constant sort of you know debt being placed on you know like a karmic sort of lineage here and it's because this person you know they turned to spell work to defeat someone and they took them out without you know second thought here they took them out for riches goods and you know money and stuff and you know i'm just here to give you the confirmation this is the truth what you thought was the truth you know god knows you know the truth like I said, this person's stuck in the duar, they have no way out and you know the only way is for this person to confess and repent their sins right now and you know I don't see this person doing that because they're you know they're enjoying this money they're you know they're paying you know Peter to end Paul sort of energy and they're you know they're just thinking when it comes to riches and you know profit I'm hearing high life again I'm hearing something about highlights so this person could just be you know posting pictures of some sort of high life they're living god sees all that's what i'm picking up here this person played god with the wrong energies here they tried to not only kill someone here they did commit murder and they're the cause and they tried to take you you out as well you know putting you in the system and making people hurt you when you knew the truth here i feel like this person has lost all protection from their angels their guides from the most high and i'm hearing the devil wants payment so this person's definitely going to lose they could lose their marriage lose their like i said they've lost their spiritual protection so there'll be no one there for this person and no one seems to be watching them liking them subscribing to them or following them so you know people are starting to turn away from this person and you know their karma will be whatever they did to you unfortunately you know they sent you crazy but they're the one with the mental illness and they're the one who is going to deteriorate when it comes to their mental health here and you know the losses of everything and everyone that this person knows of 
you know, you wasn't wrong, you was right here. The ace of swords is speaking to me. It's like, you know, whatever thoughts, whatever dreams, whatever you knew here was handed to you by this person who died. They're around you, they're trying to, you know, message you, they're trying to tell you what happened and it's all true. You are seeing what you're seeing. You are hearing what you're hearing. You are dreaming what you're dreaming. It is the truth. That's what I'm seeing here. I hope this message confirms or gives you the clarity that you needed. And if you'd like a personal reading, because this is a general message here, but if you'd like a personal reading, please email me. My details are in the description box below. And I hope you're okay. Okay, just be strong because God is giving you the strength to keep going here and to rebuild your life. Okay, so I hope this message helps you. I was just told not to go backwards here. These people are not to be trusted. They kicked you when you was down here and they didn't hear you out.